In this video I'm going to tell you how you can add sources to your Mendeley Reference Manager. Before I do that I want you to take a look at this column on the left hand side and you will see things like collections. What this means is you're probably going to be doing more than one assignment or you have more than one subject. So you can either have all your references in one long list or you can put your references into specific collections for example poverty education. So then I know these are just the references related to that topic. To create a new one you just click over here on new collection give it a name and it's there. Now you also see things like stars. What you can do is, is you can mark these stars for your favorites. Things that you're going to be using often that you like. And if you only want to see them you can click here on favorites and you'll only be shown your favorites. Or you can organize by recently added, recently read and so forth. Now let's get back to how do I actually add items into these libraries. And there are a few ways to do this. The most important button to look at is the Add New up here. You click there and you see Files from Computers. So say for instance you've been doing research and you've been finding a lot of PDF articles and you want to add them in. So to do that is you go here, you click on fi Add Files from Computer. You go down to the folder that you have been saving them in. So say for instance, I do not David. Click there. And I see all the PDFs, the articles that I have found. And then you can highlight them and you can say open and they will get added into the library. The next way to add is by adding manually. Now say for instance, you want to use a book, a physical book or a video or something that is not a PDF into the resources then you will have to do it manually and to do that you will have to fill in the fields so first of all check what kind of source is it, is it a book, is it an encyclopedia article, whatever it is you choose that and then you start filling in the fields and once they are added then they will appear inside your library and then another thing that you can do is is import a library. So say for instance you've been getting journal articles from online and you want to export them. Now this is probably rarely used. But what you can do is save these uh, f formats over here, RIS and so forth. You save them in a list and then you can import them into Mendeley. And then another thing that you can do is, is to add references straight from a website. Uh, but before you do that, what you have to do is, is you have to install Mendeley Web Importer. So depending on the browser you have, you will get an add-on that you can add to your browser. And how it works is, is if I go to this article over here that I found in a database, when I look up here I see a button for Mendeley, I click on it, and it tells me all the sources it is finding on this page. You mark the one that you're interested in and you say add. And once it's you've clicked that, it will be added into Mendeley automatically. So this is how you basically add sources into your Mendeley library.